Since taking office in 2016, President Tsai Ing-wen has sent People First Party Chairman James Song twice to the APEC summit to represent Taiwan. A recent report says that this year, the Tsai administration is looking for another candidate to represent Taiwan, possibly former Premier Lin Chen. Today, the presidential office has denied the report, saying that local media should take care not to become a mouthpiece for, quote, external forces. PFP Chairman James Song accompanies his party members as they register for the local elections. Song has been in the public limelight frequently as of late. One recent report says this year, his role as Taiwan's envoy to November's APEC summit could be in jeopardy. Local media has reported that Taiwan may have to sit out of the APEC meeting this year for what would be the second time in the history of the summit. The report said that high-level Taiwanese officials were dissatisfied with Song's performance last year and were considering alternatives including former Premier Lin Quan. I implore our president and also our government to publicly state who leaked this. I'd like to hear their advice for me. If I haven't done well, I will reflect on that. Faced with Song's apparent anger, the presidential office quickly released a statement in which it hailed Song's outstanding contributions not only in multilateral diplomacy, but also on a range of policy issues. It said the president was very grateful for Song's efforts. The statement also noted that news media should adhere to professionalism so as not to become a mouthpiece for, quote, external forces.